The Metro Nashville police releasing surveillance video of the moments leading up to the shooting there at the Covenant School, that grade school that left three young children dead and three administrators dead as well. We want to show you that right now. We want to just warn you that uh, this is very graphic and viewer discretion is advised. It does show the moments uh, the shooter entered the school uh, and began looking around. Uh, let's watch. Okay, so there you can see the vehicle the shooter drove, that 28-year-old from Nashville, driving up in the parking lot here uh, of the school. This was released just uh, moments ago by the Metro Nashville Police Department. Uh, the shooter, who the police identified as Audrey E. Hale, saying that the individual identifies as transgender, entered the building by firing through a side door. There you see it. The shooter walks in, kicks the glass, armed with two assault-style weapons and a handgun. That's according to John Drake. He's the Nashville police department chief there. So remember, the police identified six victims in this shooting there, the shooter, and you can see bracing the weapon, the sirens it looks like going off there. And remember, viewer discretion is advised. Uh, this literally just happened this morning, uh, and emotions are still raw and still very, very fresh for this community, uh, as now they are seeing this as well. The moments uh, that that 28-year-old shooter walked into the Covenant School there in Metro Nashville and started shooting. There it looks like they pass some type of front entrance this is at a private Christian elementary school. Okay, so that is there. The first video uh, released by Metro Nashville Police. Very, very difficult to watch, but you saw the moments uh, there. Audrey Hale firing these weapons uh, to get into this side door, shattering the glass of the door. Uh, take a look, though. Uh, police also released photos of the weapons that were used. Okay, so there you can see, looks to, looks to have some type of uh, sticker decal on the magazine. And there, the handgun as well. Okay, so uh, you're getting a better sense now uh, of the weapons, at least uh, what they look like. You, you saw uh, the shooter there enter the school with those two uh, assault weapons. I want to put up now uh, this photo here. Uh, this is yet another photo uh, of the entrance. And there you can see, I, I just want to pause this right here. Take a look at the upper window there. Okay, so the shooter went to the second floor firing shots before being killed by police. Uh, the police chief, John Drake, said that the assailant was, quote, at one point a student at the school there. Uh, and so uh, there you can see the broken, shattered glass in that second story window uh, as well. So we wanted to make sure Metro Police just releasing this photo as well. So that is what we were told in one of the press conferences today. Hale was firing from that second story window, 14 minutes, then officers shot that individual. And there you can see 
The individual also shot at a police cruiser there uh, in the parking lot that was responding to the mass casualty incident as well.